Hello everyone, this is Karan here. Welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. I am back with a new video. In this video, we are gonna take a look at the review of ZUI Custom Room, which is based on Android 10. And uh, what are the things working? What are the bugs you get there? And how to install this room? Everything in this video. So make sure you watch this video till the end. Let's get straight to the video. So here as you can see this is Redmi Note 8 I have installed on my this is Redmi Note 8 I have installed ZUI on my Redmi Note 8 as you can see ZUI 11.5 is the version which is based on Android 10 and this has a security patch of 1st of November 2019 which is a very old security patch this is the ported ROM from a GSI so you get some bugs here and there we will look at those bugs first of all let's take a look at the home screen some animations are laggy like this one but not that much issue sometimes it shows like this but has no issue at all the Geekbench score is very good let me show you first the Geekbench score which you get in this custom room is the Geekbench score which you get in this custom room is 314 is a single core score 1378 is the multi core score which is a very very good Geekbench score so performance is not bad gaming is also very good you can use this room as not your daily driver actually but if you want to try out something cool something new stuff on your Redmi Note 8 then you can try out this room this is the main thing uh, this is the main home screen which you get this is the quick settings panel which has these tiles available which you can just go and and check out these tiles like this one and uh, other things like there's a brightness bug here when you load this this one after this point of time after this here you will see no effect in brightness changing so this was also available in oxygen os also but uh, in this room you also get this one this is not fixed yet but that's not a big case because brightness is nice it's properly visible to almost everyone so there could be this could be the no issue at all other things like these apps are not installed these apps are not installed these apps are not installed some apps are there which are not installed some apps are in chinese language you can see some are blotware you can uninstall this blotware with the help of root method and system app uninstaller but uh, if you still don't want to use out then that's a good thing because this room has a lot of blotware so it's better if you want to use this room remove this blotware because this could cause problems to your device other things like this is a file manager you got all the storages are visible phone and sd card both are visible properly there is no issue at all but there is a bug of mtb you can't transfer files between phone and pc so this is a bug which you get here but uh, this bug is not solved yet so this is an issue this could be fixed in next build soon messages app is there phone app is there Volt is properly working. I have called sometimes ago when Volt is properly working without any issues. Wi Fi, wo Wi Fi is not available. So, Wi Fi calling is not available in this room. That's also an issue. This one is not available too. This is the contacts app. And this one is the camera app, which is also not working at all. So, that's also a big case. But uh, that's not an issue. You can try out some other apps from Google Play Store. As you can see, I have tried open camera. It, it was also working perfectly without any issue issues at all i have tried some time ago open camera was working let's take a look at some other things gcam this was in the google camera is it working or not i don't think so yes you can see google camera is also not working so if you just want to try out some camera some new stuff then you can just try out this room but google camera is not working main camera is not there some apps are in chinese and there is a lot of things are there this room can't be used as a daily driver I already told you you just want to chew if you just want to check out some new UI some new fresh look then you can use this room security app is here which has some features available clean space acceleration traffic monitor app log is available that's a very good thing some things are properly working some things are very good in this room like when you go to settings you have a lot of features available mobile network passcode and fingerprint fingerprint is there which is also perfectly working without any issues at all you have the navigation gestures which are also working as you can see i'm using navigation gestures wallpaper theme and font there is a theme available these are the themes installed pre-installed you can try out these themes like let me try superhero simply click on apply 
it will be automatically applied and here it is theme is properly applied so that's a very good thing as you get the theme is properly working let me change it to default once again uh, that's a very good thing at least themes are there so you can customize your device other things like fonts are there which you can customize but you can't customize your device with these fonts because these are these should be in chinese i have not tried one and as you can see these are in chinese how could you install these fonts so that's not for us other things like notification and status bar you have the option of badges lock screen notification sound etc display and brightness you have the option to choose brightness always on display dc backlight screen timeout and auto rotate screen font size more display and this one is the hdr10 ultra hd vision that's a very good thing as you can see other things like sound and vibration vibration is available folding tone is available battery zdu lab general settings these are the lot of things screenshot record screen storage all other things are available you can go and try it out so this was all from the settings this was all from today's video how to install this room what simply you have to do is you have to go to recovery mode install this room format data and reboot there is no complicated process i have not i don't have the room zip file so i cannot show you how to install this room it's a very simple thing i will write the whole thing on my website you can go and check out from there so this was all from today's video i hope you like it thanks for watching goodbye see you in the next video soon